Hi, welcome to a tutorial about how to flash the new race flight bootloader to your FC. This will enable you to have much faster firmware flashing and lightning fast black box download. So first thing you need to do is to plug in your FC and make sure to use the latest um, configurator version which is avail available at your point. So then you go update firmware and go to DVU mode. Now your flag control should be found by your computer. If it's not the case, like here, go open Zadig, click options, list all devices, search for your STM32 bootloader and replace the driver with WinUSB. Okay, now you see um, Welcome to DFU mode. And now what you need to do is load firmware file and select the um, new recovery file, which name ever this file has. Now that's a beta, beta version of the file. Click it and now you see that the chip is being flashed and this will take a while. Uh, let's skip this. Okay, now writing data is coming to an end quite soon. Verifying data, and now it's done. Now you open your Windows Explorer, and you see that there is a new folder, two new uh, drives. It's RaceFlight, RF Bootloader, and the log. Though don't hassle about the logs, that's a bit at the moment this video was shut, and um, they will find your black box logs in the future and we take care about this drive. So now you search for your new firmware you want to flash. So mine is in the download folder. And just copy the new Super Revolt firmware I have here inside this drive. It will take a short while. It's getting copied here and now you would see the FC blinking so the file is being flashed and the FC automatically reboots and now I can plug out the USB and plug the FC back in restart my configurator and now you see welcome pilot and I can connect to my flight control um, and the devices, the drives are gone again. So the, the, the drives you don't, you just see in the update firmware menu while the FC is in the bootloader mode and if in the normal mode you don't see any devices.